Dear me, I know you're hurting right now, but please don't shut me out. I hate seeing you like this. When I'm looking in the mirror into those big blue eyes, all I can see is sadness and I feel so powerless because I can't help you and I can't make it better. I know you're probably tired because life goes on and you have to put on a brave face for the world and pretend everything is okay. But please know that you don't have to pretend with me. If you want to talk about it, I'm here. If you want to talk about something else so you can just forget everything for a while, I can do that too. Just don't be upset if I check on you from time to time. I do it because I care and I'm worried about you. And so is everyone else. They mean well. I just want to help in any way I can. Just open up to me and tell me what it is that you need. All I want to do is hug you tight and let you know everything will be okay. I want you to know that you can rely on me even when you can't rely on anyone else. That I'm thinking of you even when no one else cares. And that I'm here for you no matter when you need me even if no one else is. But most important of them all, I want you to know that you are loved. You have known sadness and it has made you kind. You exist too much, feel too much, think too much, care too much. Reality is crushing the life out of you. You hate being cr clumsy with words since words mean so much to you. Just be gentle with yourself. You are a child of the universe no less than the trees and the stars and you have a right to be here. How do I teach you some way of being human without destroying us? Don't be afraid to speak too much, feel too much, think too much, and care too much. In a world where hearts are as cold as ice and words are being drawn back in fear of rejection, always say how you feel. You never know how kind words help people with their own battle. Words are powerful. They either kill a person or they help heal a wound faster and the choice is yours to use it. In the midst of worries, always remember everyone who terrifies you is 75% water and everyone you love is made of stardust and I know sometimes you can't even breathe deeply in the night sky schemes more like home and you have cried yourself to sleep enough times that you are down to your last 2% but nothing is infinite. Not even loss. You are made up of the sea and the stars and one day you are going to find yourself again. I know you thought of him last night. I know because we feel the same hurt. I felt the breathlessness. I felt the shaking. I felt our heart pounding its way out of our ribcage but don't forget we also felt Willow, remember? She was there through it with us, and she understood and even offered her hand. It's okay. Because people will always be there when it gets like this. You just need to know that you are a jigsaw, my darling, left to be solved. People played with you and broke you into more pieces, yet you never complained. Even missed them. No one tried to solve your problems but him, and I guess that's the hardest part to get over. You're a challenge and someone finally completed it. But he never knew that a jigsaw puzzle can never be a permanent picture. So, he left. It's divided into several pieces, many lines separating. You are able to be broken again, easily, and you were. You're still not a perfect, complete picture and you never will be. You are a jigsaw puzzle. You're made to be completed and broken again and again. I'm hurting, but that's okay.